here about shoot another video, man. You know what I'm saying? Right here down to Staten Island, shoot my boy video. You know what I'm saying? It's like six something in the morning. I'm a morning dude now, so I don't give a fuck. Hey, what you do with your back, man? You good money, man. Like so, I don't mind getting up at 4 o'clock in the morning. Do what I do, man. So, they wait for the South Ferry. Get down to Staten Island. You know what I'm saying? So, my boy will pick me up. Go down to the woods and shit. Shoot his film. You know what I mean? So, see how I get on the train, man. Coffee. Oh, yeah, just got off the ferry, man. You know what I'm saying? Lit. Ferry's right here. Lit, though. If I go downstairs, wait for my boy. Pick me up. You know what I'm saying? Nobody's here tonight. We shall see. So good, y'all. Another day, another day. Well, it depends. So, yeah. Um, like the show, I was doing more. Okay. And then, um, when we go on break or whatever, or we when we have a long, like a long period of time. Go ahead and turn it off, that way you can save on battery. So, um, yeah. So just throw it again, yeah. really quick. It shouldn't go, it should be between 18 and 12 for both. Yeah. Right? Uh -huh. And if it goes too high, I turn it down. If it goes too low, turn it off. Yeah. Right. And that's it. I've seen the before clips, man. I'm just showing off my, um, my last shoot. I did my boy in Staten Island. You know what I'm saying? We shot his short film. Came out pretty good. We had fun. The actors was good. We, we, we all worked as a team. And we took care of business, you know what I'm saying? That's why I love, that's why I always tell y'all to do what you love, man. Make that your purpose, make that your passion, man. You know what I'm saying? Everything gonna be all right. Just gotta have faith that you will make it, man. You know what I mean? A lot of people, they don't fucking do what they love, man. They just, they just do what they do for the money. But they hate their jobs. You know what I'm saying? End of the day, your spirit not be fulfilled, man. You just fucking making yourself stressed out and all that extra shit. You know what I mean? It's not cool, man. So I'm glad that the most high woke me up and made me to discover my talents and making me pursue my talents. Start my own production company, man. All present to the most high, man. So today's video is going to be breaking your generation curses, man. It's going to be a little deep topic. You know what I'm saying? Maybe a lot of people don't know. Some people probably question, like, why I'm going through this? Why my family have bad luck? Why everything is so dark? Why, why, why? Everybody's so negative in my family, you know what I'm saying? It's a generation curse. Generation of curse, man. Just gotta break it. Bottom line. We all curse as a people, especially you got the skin color, man. We all curse. They yeah, all talk about it in the, you know what I'm saying? Deuteronomy 28. Talk about the curses. That our people went through from my forefathers, you know saying disobeying the most high laws. That's what happened, man. But generation curses within the family, man. It's kinda like the same thing. But the most high choose that one person to break that curse, man. It's up to you to break it. Since you know the knowledge that your family's curse. Going through a curse, you're chosen to break it, man. That's why you're going through the hard time, the hardship you're going through right now. You keep it real. 
I know my family's going through a, 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 a generational curse. I've seen it. It's like it's crazy. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to put my family business out there, but that's what we're going through. I see the downfall. I, I saw the, the negative vibes, the negative practices my family doing. You know what I'm saying? Like with the, you know, the alcohol, the smoking, all the extra stuff, man. I'm proud. I take steps step to break that generation curse. I don't smoke no more. I hardly drink. I drink once in a while. Maybe two times a year, if that. You know what I'm saying? Whatever your parents do, or whatever your parents' demons they have, and you see it, break it. Because dumb demons gonna pass down to the next generation. And you don't want that to be carried on. To, to the future kids of your family you know what I'm saying that's why you gotta break that generational curse you know what I mean that's a fact if you st still doing your wicked ways or whatever you're doing your past generations were doing maybe smoking weed drinking a lot of alcohol smoking cigarettes fighting or the extra activity you know what I'm saying you pass that seed down to your kids, man. Passing that negative spirits down to your kids, and your kids gonna end up being the same way. It don't matter you teach them the right way. You pass that generous curse down to the kids. You know what I'm saying? They will catch on sooner or later. You know what I mean? That's why if you figure it out, if you know about the general the, the generation curses, you figure it out and you decide to break that curse man you've been chosen the most I chose you to break them curse man now you got a mission to break that curse you know what I mean hey that could be your purpose in life to break your bloodline curse break it break that curse man you know what I mean break that curse I've been new. Yeah, man. I, like, that shit's real. Generation curse is real, man. You gotta see it within your family. See it, break it. You can't break it in one day. It might take years. Once you break it, break it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to have no seed right now until I break my generation curse. Then have my seed. You know what I mean? Then my C generations, future generations of my family, would be straight. You know what I'm saying? New opportunities. That's why I'm starting my own business. New opportunities for my next generation, man. You know what I mean? They could grow up. Don't have to work for nobody but me. And the business. You know what I'm saying? Word. But that's how you gotta do it, man. Get your wisdom, get your knowledge. You know what I mean? See things. See the wrong in things. Let's break the curse. You know what I mean? Hey, if you don't believe your family ain't cursed, then so be it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know your family, but the people who know. Or want to find out why they going through bad times you know what I'm saying that person their family going through bad times you might be going through a generation curse man you know what I mean it's time for you to break it break that curse and turn over the new leaf in your family man make everything good you feel me it takes one person or a couple of people to do it in your family to realize that yeah it's time it's time to break it break this curse you know what i mean hey i know this video is going to reach to somebody this video ain't too long you know what i'm saying i don't want to get too deep on it you know what i'm saying on this sabbath day shabbat shalom to everybody out there man you know what i'm saying 
So on that note, I'm gonna drop a lock video tomorrow because I'm getting my locks done. Getting my dreads done tomorrow. So I'll drop another video, a lock update for Sunday. You know what I'm saying? Beginning of the work week. You know how we do. So if you like this video, smash that like button. And you want to see more videos of me, Jay Powerful from Black Scorpion Films, hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. To get notified when I drop these videos, man. You know what I'm saying? Support the channel, man. Hit that like button. Drop a comment, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's get this channel to 1,000, man. That's goals, man. I'm goal chasing. Let's do it. Ah, right, y'all. Shabbat shalom.